Hi everyone, welcome back to the Codeshop channel. In today's video, we're exploring automatic transfers in Odoo 18. This feature automates financial transactions between accounts, reducing manual work and improving accuracy. So let's jump right in and I'll show you exactly how to set it up. To get started, let's open the accounting module, go to the accounting tab and select transfers. Here we can see a list of existing automatic transfers. Let's create a new one by clicking on the new button. Start by entering a description for the transfer. Let's name it reallocating money for specific business needs. Let's define the period during which it should take place. We'll set it from January 1st to the present. Then choose the frequency such as monthly, quarterly or yearly, depending on your needs. Additionally, you can select the appropriate journal for these transfers to ensure proper categorization within your accounting records. The origin accounts and automated transfer fields allow you to specify the accounts involved in the transfer. These accounts define the source and destination of the funds. The origin account is the bank account from which the funds will be withdrawn. This is usually a bank account. It must be properly configured with details such as account code, bank name, and other relevant information. You can set this up by clicking on the bank line directly in the pop-up, or by navigating to the configuration tab. The automated transfer account is the destination where the funds will be deposited. This can be, for example, the expenses account or any other account you select from the list. If necessary, you can also create a new one over here. Next, specify the percentage of the total sum of lines from the origin account that should be transferred to the destination account. For example, we can set it to 10%. Additionally, the partner filter option allows you to add conditions to transfer only the sum of lines from the origin account that match specific partners' accounts. Similarly with the analytics filter. You can set conditions to transfer only sum of lines that match specific analytic accounts. These filters help refine the transfer process based on predefined criteria. Okay, now that everything is set up, let's click Save. At this stage, the transfer is still inactive. To start it, click the Activate button, and this status will change from Disabled to Running. Next, let's click Compute Transfer. This will generate transactions based on the configured schedule and rules. Under the Transfer Smart button, you can view details such as the reference, the amount, and the origin and destination accounts. In the bank journal, the transfer amount is recorded as a credit. In the expense or destination account, it appears as a debit. At the top, there are three action buttons. You can pause the entry. To confirm the transaction, print the details if needed, and cancel the transfer if any adjustments are required. Lastly, on the configuration page, you can pause the transfer at any time by clicking the Disable button. And that's how to set up automatic transfers in Auto 18. I hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.